somebody. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Glory. Has God been good to anybody? Amen. Come on. Amen. I need to SSB. Yeah. Amen. I, I forgot all, all about that. Amen. But we, we thank God for Pastor Dupree. Uh, uh, every, it, people don't know you at our church, but they know you. Uh, amen. They know you because uh, I, I tell everybody, anywhere I go, everywhere I go, you change my life. Amen. Amen. And y'all to be excited. I mean, he changed my life. I came to him. Amen. I was a, grew up in the church, but you know how that go. And uh, walked into the church with my Jerry curl and uh, my earrings. Amen. I, I was supposedly tough. And uh, Pastor Dupree preached all in my face. And, man, I mean, it was it was something because. I remember receiving the baptism of the Holy Ghost and you were going down the line and before you laid hands on me, I was already shot a Honda. Shot a Honda. You know, I, I was gone, amen. But I, but I tell everybody everywhere I go, no matter what I do, uh, my life would not be near where it is had it not been for this man of God. Amen. It changed my life. I would not be half the preacher that I am. I, amen. I've been privileged to preach a lot of places before a lot of crowds. And I tell you, I would tell anybody that this man, this man right here, changed my life. Amen. And so we thank God for him. Amen. Come on, give it up for him. Amen. He stuck with me, bro. Church, church couldn't handle me. Amen. Church couldn't handle me. I need I needed somebody who would feel with the spirit and not just going to church. Because I had some things going on. Amen. Amen. I had some things working in me and I needed somebody to confront those issues. Amen. Somebody. And I just thank God He stuck with me. Amen. Ordained me a deacon. Amen. And I accepted my call. I remember when I accepted my call, I was so embarrassed and ashamed to sit in the pulpit. He said, No, nah, come on, sit in the pulpit. Amen. It just really, just really gave me that confidence, amen, as a man of God. And I, I mean, I, I mean, I could go on for, for hours and hours about the stories and the things, amen. We've had some great times. We would go out evangelizing door to door. We had some close encounters with the, with the weird kind. <laughs> amen. amen. Witnessing. Remember the big, y'all please bear with me. I, I, I mean, I, you know, we remember the big guy wanted to fight. Yeah. Wanted to fight because he he was fight wanted to fight about bat, being baptized or something like that. He was a oh man, we had some we had some, yeah yeah yeah. I did say the grow boy. We've had some some encounters, but 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 he taught me how to witness. We would go door to door, amen. We would train in the church and have I mean just conflict resolution as it relates to going out and witnessing it, amen. But I thank God for my wife who came with me. We had it. amen. Give it up for her. Amen. A great preacher in her own right. Amen. And so we thank God for her. Amen. We had some others that were supposed to come, but you know how that goes. Had some that were on the road, had to turn around because their car uh, started acting up. And it wasn't nothing but the devil, but amen. But we we, we, we we had some we just couldn't wait on. Yeah, that's right. We had to, you know, you know, when you're on an assignment, you just have to roll out. That's right. Amen. You have to roll out. Amen. So we thank God. Come on, get your Bibles in your hand. And let's dig in this word. 
Amen. And go to Job chapter 23. Job chapter 23. Amen. We thank God for the first lady. Amen. All right. Amen. Amen. I, I, I never mentioned, so I was I was gonna throw it out there and see. <laughs> Amen. But we thank God for you as well. Amen. 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 Job 23. Amen. My tie already loose. Amen. And what I'm gonna do is go ahead and take this jacket off. Make no mistake about it. I came to preach. Amen. 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 I, I'm here. I'm here for that reason and that reason only. Amen. I'm here to preach. Job 23. Everybody got to shout glory. 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 We're going to commence in that narrative at verse number 10. That will be our one and only verse. Amen. Now let's start at verse 9. Everybody ready? Amen. Verse 9 says, On the left hand, where doth he work? But I cannot behold him. He hideth himself on the right hand, that I cannot see him. But he knoweth the way that I take. When he hath tried me. Somebody say me. 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 Now, I'm the kind of preacher that you got to talk back to. Yes, sir. Amen. And so I want to make sure that you understand if I ask you to talk to me, talk back to me. Yes, sir. Amen. So we can enjoy this word. Amen. 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 He said, he knoweth the way that I take, but when he had tried me, everybody shout me. Me. I shall come forth as though. Now I want you, I want you to just, just for a moment look at somebody square in the eye. Amen. Look at somebody square in the eye as you prepare to make a prophetic declaration about your own life. Amen. Because God is getting ready to do something. Make no mistake about it. It makes no difference how many people are here or are not here. Amen. God is about to drop a word in your spirit that's going to revolutionize your life. It's going to shift your thinking. You're getting ready to... Somebody ought to get happy. Y'all ain't happy enough. I feel God in here. Hey, get ready for your ship. Ah, y'all go shake. I did it. It's about a fire. Yeah, go shout. And God get ready to do something in this church. The ah, I, I see it breaking out on the right and on the left. I hear the Lord saying, enlarge your tents. Uh, my God, strengthen your cords. Uh, because God is about to do something. Shake up. My God, I feel the glory in here. It's consecrated right up in here. I can feel the anointing. Everybody lift your hands up. I can feel the glory of the Lord. It's consecrated right up in here. My God, everybody just stretch your hand this way. Because God can ready to give you a touch even now before we jump in this world. God can ready to give you a touch. My God, I feel his glory. I feel his glory. My God, he don't say they bullshit. My God, my God. Look at somebody, look at somebody, amen. Thank you, thank you. And I want you to, at the count of three, I want you to shout, I'm coming out of this. Amen. One, two, three. I'm coming out of this. Okay. 
situation. Amen. And if in fact I'm expecting God to do something, then I must show it in my actions. Amen, somebody. If you are waiting on a patchy package from there, if you are anticipating someone to come by your house, every time you hear a sound, you peep it out of the curtain. Every Choose whether or not he's going to throw in the towel. He said you can take 